Good day. Today, quick presentation how to start build CNC from floppy disk drive. So you want to build something like that from scrap computer parts, but you don't know where to start? First, research YouTube for ideas how to make CNC fr from floppy disk drive or DVD-ROM. They have bigger travel. You need computer power supply unit to power this thing. You take three floppy disk drive really i needed four to build but put them together to make three axis cnc you need parallel socket cable makes easier to connect to parallel printer cable and with computer parallel port here you have pinout on your floppy disk drive and what they do and here you have pinout for parallel connection and what they do now take floppy disk drive and connect pin 12 of floppy disk drive to ground with jumper sometimes it's necessary to connect pin 16 to ground as well to make everything work then connect pin 18 and 20 from floppy disk drive to pin 2 and 3 of parallel socket cable next Connect floppy disk drive ground pin to parallel socket cable ground pin. Again, refer to pinout presented earlier. Here you see jumper at pins 12 and 16 on floppy disk drive and three temporary wires connected to parallel socket. Green wire from pin 2 of that parallel socket will go to pin 20 of floppy disk drive. Yellow wire from pin 3 of parallel socket will go to pin 18 of floppy disk drive. Brown wire from ground pin of parallel socket go to any ground pin on floppy disk drive. Look here, different photo, same story with pinout connection as earlier. Connect those wires directly to pins 18, 20 and ground of floppy disk drive. Now connect socket cable with parallel printer cable to computer. Connect power supply unit to your floppy disk drive. Power it up. Look here. Power supply is on, but no jumpers on floppy disk drive. So floppy disk drive is not switched on yet. Look here. Power supply is on, Jumper on pin 12 makes floppy disk drive switched on. Green LED light indicate that. Sometimes you need to jumper pin 16 as well to make stepper motor to work. Now connect socket cable with parallel printer cable to computer. Here all connections made and power on. On computer install Parmon that is parallel port monitor. It is a small program you can find and download from net. It works in Windows environment, control it with mouse. With pins 3 and 2 here, you can control pins 18 and 20 of the floppy disk drive. Pulsating pin 2 here make on and off pin 20 on floppy disk drive, which is step input of stepper motor. To change direction of stepper motor, you are changing state of pin 3 to low or high, that means connecting to ground or disconnecting from ground, pin 18 of floppy disk drive. If you get it everything right, you can control stepper on floppy disk drive. So make that three times for three axes. Of course, you use other pins on parallel socket, four and five for second axis and 6 and 7 for third axis. Instead controlling manually, you can do that with software, Linux CNC. We will do that next time.